and welcome to the Daily Bible Podcast. My name is William Hemsworth. Thank you so much for joining me for today's episode. Well, yesterday on the Daily Bible, we started Matthew chapter 10. And so obviously we're going to be continuing in Matthew chapter 10 uh, for the next well few days. And today we're going to be looking at Matthew chapter 10, verses 5 and 6. And these verses are very unique to Matthew's gospel. Some may even think they're a little controversial, but... I don't think that's the case. I think it's easily explained. So here we go. Matthew chapter 10, verses 5 and 6 say, These twelve Jesus sent out with the following instructions. Go nowhere among the Gentiles, and enter no town of the Samaritans. But go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. Now I imagine someone out there going, Whoa, 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 I thought Jesus came for everybody. Amen. He did. But to understand this verse a little more, we need to have an understanding of the Old Testament. You see, in the Old Testament, Israel was God's chosen people. God chose them. This reflects the order of salvation history. So God adopted the Israelites as his own possession in Exodus uh, 19. Five. So it was appropriate that they hear the good news of the gospel of the new covenant first. Now, after Jesus' resurrection, in the same gospel of Matthew, we read about the Great Commission, about how Jesus is telling his disciples to go to all nations, to teach them everything that he's commanded and baptize them in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. So yes, Jesus is for everyone. But he's following the order that everything was laid out in the Old Testament. How Israel, as God's chosen people, hear the new covenant first. And as we see later on in the New Testament, a lot of them reject it, and then from then, especially with the Apostle Paul, it gets spread among the Gentiles, ultimately to us. Praise God. So a couple of things I want to go over. Jesus says, go nowhere among the Gentiles or enter no town of the Samaritans. These are pretty specific directions. Now, only in Matthew's gospel does Jesus place this limit on the disciples' ministry. And so the Samaritans obviously were inhabitants of Samaria, but they were part of what was known as the Northern Kingdom before the Assyrians took over in 722 uh, BC. And the Samaritans, their lineage is from those Israelites who married the Assyrians and kind of intermingled. And so they were ceremonially unclean. And it's the same for Gentiles. That's why Jesus said, Don't go among them first. Go to Israel first because that's going to build. It's more of a credibility thing. You go to Israel first. That way they're not seeing you among the Gentiles and the Samaritans. And they're not going to consider you unclean. There's a better chance of them welcoming you. Like I said, Jesus isn't being. He's not denigrating anyone. He's following the order of how things were laid out in the Old Testament. And as we see later on, everything ultimately works out. Everything comes around for all of us. Jesus is for everyone. No doubt about that. God bless you guys. Thank you for joining me in this edition of the Daily Bible Podcast. As always, if you enjoy the show, I just ask that you share it. Please do. And if you have any comments, any prayer requests, please email me at hopewithin18 at gmail.com. God bless you guys. Have a great day.